Hello? Hello? Testing, testing, one, two, three. Ah, dang, dude. I, dang, dude. The audio is like muted. It got muted. Oof. Well, that sucks. Because I was going on about how, how what's this um, vid game is based off of and stuff. Like, I was trying to be informative, but I guess um, the, my freaking microphone hates me now, so I don't know why it's acting that way. But sorry for the, the little uh, technical difficulties. <laughs> As some people in industry might um, might say, but yeah, welcome by back everybody to another live stream. Um, I'm gonna probably cut this live stream a little short than usual, just because of the fact that I'm, I have other stuff I need to do afterwards. So yeah. You change the definition when you get get it working. Uh, yeah. I don't know, dude. Alright, um, so I'm working on... First, my main goal of this is... I'm just trying to get the script written out before I, like, actually work on the user interface of the game. Um, which isn't clean or anything. I can probably make it cleaner. I have a design, um... I have a specific design I'm gonna go for with this game so but as of now I'm just working on the script so it's gonna be kind of boring but like I think I did mention that I'm gonna cut this live stream a little short because um, I have other things to do but I'm pretty much just gonna be working on the script right now and yeah that's pretty much it I don't know is the is the audio too loud I don't know dude Ah, why can't this be easy? <laughs> Bruh. Yeah, um, hold on. Hold on a sec. Okay, it looks like it's working. It's just that you might have to refresh your browsers if you still can't hear me. So I don't know, it's, it's kind of dumb, but it's just how it is. Make the audio louder. Uh, hold on a sec. I don't want to make it too loud because I feel like if I make it too loud, it's gonna over. It's gonna feel. It's gonna be too powerful. I don't know. But yeah, welcome back, everybody. Uh. Okay. First, I kind of want to fix this. Um. Let's see. Main story Rinpai. Script line eighteen. Okay, what is it saying? In script, hey, you get exception slayer T O is not defined. Okay, so I did not define T one. Yeah, I guess I forgot how to um to define it. That's probably why. Teacher, because because I, I did say because I did say that I was gonna add multiple teachers to this game. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna add. This, this, and this, and stuff like that. Let's see. Girl 1, girl 2, boy 1, boy 2. Okay. Teacher 1. Um, homeroom teacher. Teacher 1, I guess. Or actually, I was just going to define it as T for this. That means I'm going to have to change this. Oh hey, thanks Aqua Dragon. Thanks for the donation, man. I got ninety six percent on my on this on my the same day I donated to you. Coincidence? I don't know, but just to be safe. Okay, congrats, man. Nice. Well, what exam is it for? 
dude if it's a math exam dude i congratulate you because i like suck at math and i praise anybody who's like very good at math so i don't know but but i appreciate the don donation aqua dragon sniper got competition <laughs> inertia hey what's up inertia doggo hey what's up um sniper gave him like <laughs> bruh competing in piano skills on vc <laughs> yeah uh let's see okay so i need to change this to just t um, let's see i think it's just those lines yeah i'm pretty sure it's just this way unless unless i have more up here which i do not okay so it's just those two I should reload. There we go. And the introduction for this is very short. Inner is not defined. What? How is it not defined? Did I not define it? Bruh, dude. Okay, so let me see. What did I not define? Let's see. Side characters to insert a name into dialogue. Um. Oh, yeah, because, like, I don't need add inner. Okay, that's why, because I could just not add anything. Punch kick. There's like an indention right there. Here's like the optional. Yeah, my cheeks hurt a bit. Let's see, um, chemistry, bruh, dude, okay, chemistry is freaking hard, I like, I hate, I don't like working, uh, doing chemistry, I never did in, in, like, any of my science classes, like, I love doing physics, but chemistry was, like, the worst, like, I could do the, um, the atom section of chemistry, where you find the, um, atomic number of a uh, atom and stuff, but I just can't, for the life of me, like, figure out how to, like, combine and stuff, like, like taking two zeros to make O2 and all that kind of shit for the more for the more complicated stuff. So I don't know, but chemistry is pretty cool. I think it's cool, but I don't know. It's really difficult for me. Hey, what's up, King Sniper? How's it going? Thanks. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, I do remember Ramen Boy. So. It's all good. It's awful at math middle. It's awful at math in middle school and it's great. I had a great teacher and started getting better over time. That's good. That's the same ex ninth grade. Put UG instead of PN. Oh yeah, boy. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right. Mm, dude, I need to work on that. Hey Jesse, how's it going? I'm fifth grader. Jonas, welcome back to the live stream. He 
Hey, Yuji, did the girl from Say, Say No Hi ever, ever texted you where the mixer's gonna be tonight? Unfortunately, I don't have her number, but that might change tonight. Dude, don't get your hopes up with your ugly face. We won't give it a chance. Say hi. What's with... What was that you're asking for, aren't you? I'd like to see you try. Hi. Guys, chill up. Plus, I'm not planning on going. It's not my kind of thing. What do you mean it's not your thing? Of course you are. I mean, if you don't go, then the girls are going to come Are you guys being serious right now? I said I've got... Just didn't... Hmm... What could be more important than this? That's none of your business. Ha ha ha. We already know. Huh? What? What are you talking about? Do your secrets out? Everyone knows you've been working at that one bar after school. Didn't you get the memo? What the hell? How? I think that's where I stopped. Yep, I did. 2.33. Return with dissolve. I just put return. All right, so that's what I have so far. It's not bad. It's not bad, guys. So there we go. So did your seekers out? Okay, so I'm I'm like about. Uh, let's see. What are you talking about? Like they had to know the look. Come on, man. I have. Yeah, it's like I'm about right here in the script. So I'm, I'm almost finished with chapter one. It's not bad. Hey, Xren? X, 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 Ren? Reen? I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce your name. Your mini game? Sure. Uh, just let me know how, how to initiate it. So. That's great though. I thought high school would last forever, but I flew by by an instant. Yeah, I agree with that, Doggo. Like, high school really does fly by in an instant without you noticing, so. Let's see, what the hell? How? Alright, so after he, after he finds out. Mm, let's see. Boy, I think boy one is going to say it. It's like, didn't you get the message? Didn't you get the me did you get the message? How long has this been in progress? I'd say for like the last four live streams, maybe. So about a month now, I guess. It's not too bad. Like, actually, no, it's probably the past three or four live. It's either three live streams ago or four. I don't know. I can't. I don't recall. I think this is the third time or fourth time or something. But I I did stop um, doing this like a while back ago, and I just recently just picked it up again. So. It's been going on for a bit, but because I already finished this ish, it, sh it should go by really fast. Like I already have the majority of it, of this right here. I have no idea how long it's this part chapter one is going to be, but it should be pretty interesting. Looks like you didn't. I'm pretty surprised. Looks like you didn't.
Yeah, no kidding. I thought I, I thought you have a, I thought you of all people would have would have found out. You would. You. I thought you would. Don't look at us, we didn't do anything. It's not like we have time to s around. It's not like we have time to stalk you around. Uh, should I say soccer football? I think because I think it's soccer, right? It was, we have the soccer. Tour. We have the soccer tourney coming up. I think I'm pretty sure I spelled that wrong. Tournament. How do I go into that insult? Let's see. I put PNG.
Dude, that's fucking brutal. What did you guys say? Um, yeah. Go into screens, then go down to my chapters menu for chapter two or whatever is after one. Type menu one, there it says episode two. Really? Okay, let me check it out. Wait, I don't see anything. Go to, to screen, then go down to my chapters menu for chapter two or whatever. So type in menu one where it says episode two. Menu one where it says episode two. What are you talking about? Uh, I don't know. I'm dumb. Not be found. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay. Oh, I don't know. I don't know, man. Eddie Crane, hey, what's up? Like the big chunga's um, profile pic. I gotcha. Is it this one right here? Y position, next position, action, start, main story. Text box to episode two. Start. Episode two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice. Oh, is this the um, chapter selection? Okay, cool. Nice. Frame style, G game navigation, X align point ninety eight. Nice. Has V box. Replace episode two with menu.
struggle. Huh, interesting. Wait, bad end? Very interesting, okay. I broke free. Megumi caught me. Very nice, very nice, Robin Boy. That looks, that's pretty cool. Are you calling that within a directory? Yeah, it's escape for child quality of life. Nice. That's pretty cool. I there's a lot of potential with that. Have you that kind of feels uh it's because I know for a fact that School Days, the visual novel, actually has like a, a mini game like that, which I think is pretty cool. Um, been thinking of watching Dr. Stone and Mob Psycho. Dude, yeah, I need to watch season two of Dr. Stone. I still haven't seen it yet. Because I, I was kind of waiting for the English dub, which it did premiere, I believe, this week or something. Or the this past weekend, um, episode one of the English dub of Dr. Stone premiered. Which, oh, dude, I am... Dude, I really want to watch it right now, but I kind of want to save at least five episodes until before I watch the whole thing. Oh, dude, I'm so hyped. There's so many good shows right now. Like, oh my god, there's so much I need to catch up on. It's ridiculous. But I'm pretty happy because there's... There's just so much I can watch right now. She really, how much, how much does she charge for a quart? That's gross. Oof. I, I wish there was like a quick command. Is there like a Renpai? I don't know, dude. Like, is there a package for Renpai in here? Um, let's see. Config? No, that's not it. It was packages or... Settings. Packages. Install. Packages. Let me see. Language Renpai. It's enabled RenPy Dialog Plus. Okay, project aiming to add additional functionality to the user interface of RenPy Dialog and Atom. Control toggles on and off word count display. What kind of plugin is this? Interesting. This might be helpful, I although I'm not it doesn't show what exactly it does. PHP language, your favorite text and code editor is now available in French within a package. Go lo language identifiers. Rename tabs. Yeah, it doesn't seem like there's any runpy packages. Well that sucks. It's like there's only two or two of them. To add functionality and user interface for RunPy dialog and Atom. Well, shit. Okay. Is there like some kind of compiler online or something where I can just pass dialog into, and it automatically um, adds whatever the double quotes and stuff to it? That because that would be pretty cool. 
Hey, what's up, Funko37? How's it going? Yeah, I, I can't wait for, for my how my game is going to turn out, too. Because, <laughs> bro, at this point, I'm like, I don't know. I've been waiting on... A new season of Rise of the Shield Hero. Bruh, I totally agree with, you, agree with you, Sniper. I'm pretty hyped for season two. I also heard that season three of Shield Hero is supposed to come out as well. Because it, it, Shield Hero did so well that they um, greenlit season three as well. If only it was that simple. Yeah, totally. Hey, what's up, Chris Akane? How's it going? Any good games you played recently? Uh, in terms of games, I don't know. I haven't really been playing a lot of games, actually. I did play, I did recently got, or I, I did recently get, like, um, the Scott Pilgrim versus the World on the Switch, because that's a game I actually wanted to play for a while, because it was exclusive for the PS3, because you can only get it through the PS3 PlayStation Store, but now that, um, Ubisoft, um, re-released it for the Switch and PS4, I'm pretty excited. Um, I played it a little bit of it, and it's really good so far. I like because I like Scott Pilgrim. It's a great story, so I recommend anybody who wants to read a comic or something that isn't Japanese or manga, or whatever. That Scott Scott Pilgrim is one of those comics that are really funny, and def I definitely recommend that and like the film itself because they're pretty good. Do you know we're at school right now and there's so many people around? Was that one? Mm. I don't think it actually is going to show scene what with the
Actually, isn't it like that? Um, let's see. Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, it is. I don't know if I want to in inner dialogue or not. Things just never work out like I hope. how much I tried to tell them. I don't know if I spelled that right. Victim. So it's an I, not a U. I figured. I'm so dumb. Like I, I suck at spelling. Even though I was the victim. I was still. I was treated. Like like a criminal. What other comics that aren't manga those exist? <laughs> yeah, totally. What game engine are you using? Yeah, Ramen Voice is Renpai. Zelda Galaxy, that's what I'm using. I've read a lot of visual novels. Next season is going to be good. Yeah. Funko. In Yandere Story Episode 11, there was a part where in the end, Sen Sen Senai seemed to be a Yand the Yandere current. Certainly a nice trick, but did you intend them both to be Yandere's or not? Uh, 
Well, essentially, Funko, I, I kind of thought about it because somebody did comment said, like, what, it be, what if there were, like, two Yandere's instead of just one? Um, I thought about it, and I was like, that might be an interesting thing to implement into a story. So I kind of tricked that. I kind of want to imply that Sanai was kind of a Yandere, but she's more, more of the um, normal kind where, um, I don't know, where she wouldn't go to the extreme kind of thing i didn't want her to be the extreme version of the, of a yandere because then things would i guess things would kind of uh, i don't know it'd be kind of weird um if you had two of them in the story i guess not not really because then people would be, be kind of shocked but it it kind of make everything too predictable so I, and i don't want to make my stories too predictable because then people are can guess like oh i bet this is gonna happen i bet this is gonna happen or whatever and then it turns out that they were right at the very beginning so i didn't want to make it too predictable so i i kind of tone it down a bit to make her not as young today as a lot of people thought she was um some people might have been disappointed i i know for that for a fact but I think I'm pretty satisfied with how she turned out as a character um, compared to what people thought she was going to be. Um, that's my opinion, though. Um, but yeah, she wasn't really intended to be a, another Yandere. Uh, she's more of like an antagonist in a way uh, as well. And I guess an antagonist to, to the antagonist of the story. I guess that's one way to put it. I don't know. Yeah, I'll, I'll get all the assets and stuff later on. So, hey, what's up, Scarlet Dusk 99 How's it going? I get inspired by these live streams, Doggo. Yeah, Doggo, go for it, man. Like, do it. Like, for the, if you got if you guys feel like writing a story, go for it. It's always pretty good to like uh immerse yourself in your own stories and like actually write them out and put them into into writing you because a lot of the times you find that the story is good or if it's not good if you think it's not good you know um you can improve on it and eventually you can make, turn it into a game like i'm doing or you can turn them into like a short animation clip or you know collaborate with somebody else to like make a video of some sort i don't know but at the end of the day, it's, you know, you be expressing yourself on paper or on computer or whatever. And it's a good thing. It's a good thing for the for the brain as well, because, you know, you, you express yourself through that. So I highly recommend people if you if this live stream inspires you to write, you know, do it because it's a good outlet to, you know, release your inner inner. Um, <laughs> I don't know what. <laughs> I don't know. What's a good writer? Edgar Allan Poe? Uh, I don't know. I think so. <laughs> to release your inner, inner Edgar Allan Poe. Because <laughs> that guy was like depressed. My man gonna create the spinoff. <laughs> That's the DLC. You f you front know how to spell a victim? No, I do not know. I'm, I'm stupid. I'm a monkey brain, guys. Monkey brain. Yonder is temporary. Monkey is forever, guys. Remember that. <laughs> Hit an Easter egg in the debug menu. Type sniper and get 100 in-game currency. And I'll get the achieve investment. <laughs> Bruh, that's funny. That's hilarious. I like that sniper. Nice. Then immediately accepts taking a shift off to go on a date. Well, uh, inertia. Uh, uh, well, I mean, if it's a, it's a, if it's a girl, you know, you're a guy, and obviously you're like, okay, yeah. I, as much as I want this money, I kind of want to go on a date with a girl. So you know, it's that kind of thing. That's my mentality for Yuji, at least. Hey, Yuzuku, how's it going? The game is amazing. Thanks, even though it's not really complete or anything yet. So appreciate it, though. <laughs> Zenith, got no idea what this is, but it piqued my interest. So, hey, hey, what's up? How's it going? Thank you for stopping by. Do be writing the DLC of the game. Are the Undead Diary episodes separate or no? It seemed that they were not, although I may be wrong. 
Uh, yes, Funko. The Yandere Diary episodes each are their own story. None of them are connected. So I just want to clarify that. I should probably clarify that. Um, but I figure I thought it was kind of inherently, inherently like, oh, uh, like already clarified that there were gonna be like a kind of like um what is it a mirror what was it what's that one mirror mirror something on netflix i forgot i totally forgot the name for ah, mirrors at i want to say mirrors edge but that's a game um black mirror yeah black mirror that's what i was thinking about i kind of wanted to make it like black mirror which where each episode it's its own continuity so yeah Even though I was a victim, I was treated like a criminal. Things just never work out like I hoped. And just like that, my high school life is over. No matter how much I tried, no one would listen. Even though I was the victim in all, in all of this. I was treated like a criminal. I asked myself why I even saved that girl. Why I even bothered to save that girl? And I just answered my own question. Kind of funny. I asked myself why I even bothered to save that girl. And I guess. Would you look at that? I just answered my own question. See you as long as I can make my mom proud. Well, I can look. What I can do. Enjoy this dump. I made a mistake. All I can do now is graduate from this dump and show them that they made a mistake.
Looks like it's already lunchtime. Looks like it's already lunchtime. Things sure go by fast when you're in deep thought. <sighs> it's a, it was about time I could feel. Sorry, buddy. It's going to be the usual for today. It's going to be the usual for today as well. It's not. I can't seem to catch a break. Yeah, I, I kind of want to make this part so it, it kind of shows that to the audience that he isn't driven. He doesn't have a lot of money to his name. Uh, let's see. Always been fascinated by the Yandere type of character. What if the in-game currency I use for a specific dialogue is the more you get, the more diverse choices you have? Cool little thing to add would be when you're in Yuji's bedroom, you have a small chance to see shadow through the curtains of a window. You clickly click a tree click a T and her the achievement stalker Vulcan just ran this game as a D and D one shot <laughs> dude inertia yeah might as well right Funko I've got the plot for Yandere Story season two episode two you should have a Yandere with a family background and hypnotism hmm interesting that's a very interesting concept I'll I'll think about it. Feel free to throw your suggestions in this Google Doc. It goes directly to Jay and me. Um, also, how did Megami, how did Megami not know Sanai was close with Yuji if she stalked him before the start of the first episode? Okay, so inertia to answer your question. Uh, the reason why Megami does not know that Sanai was close to Yuji is because it's not like Sanai, or I mean, it's not like Megami ever kind of noticed. Um, Yuji before the he knew about Yuji that he was a popular guy in school but he didn't really sh or she didn't really care to like be informed about his social life or any of that stuff so it's not like she making me cared about Yuji for um, before th this whole thing that happened um, and when she was stalking him um, is Sanai w wasn't really around him all that often at least I, I would say so um, because it did say, um, in the story, I did say that they kind of like drifted away, um, and stuff like that. So it's more like Sanai didn't want to get close to Yuji because he, he was popular with everybody and stuff like that. So as well as the fact that, um, after the whole accident happened, it was even harder for her to get closer to Yuji. So Megami didn't really get the chance to see her and Yuji get like being friendly friendly with each other so that's why i should probably add that to the story to clarify it more honestly though since i'm trying to find new possible endings for the game as you asked will the characters have their own dates later on in their roots um i don't know man like maybe i don't know i haven't really decided i haven't really finalized anything yet but i might think about that I can't spell if you can't tell. Uh, wait, is this an actual downloadable game? Yes, as Ramen Boy says, Zenith, 
it eventually will be a downloadable game so yes i do have another game called yandere doa imadeka which you can download it actually um i think it's in my discord uh, if you want to join my discord by all means please do but and just ask for it and i'll give you a link to the game but this is a totally different game but will be downloadable later on so Mm, game story manuscript 278 oh it's, i forgot the double quotes that's probably why I'm probably gonna have to skip a little bit. Um, I don't wanna fast forward too much though. Are you kidding? Does it sound like I'm okay? It's not like we would waste our time trying to find dirt on you. We have the soccer tournament coming up. Oh yeah, wasn't Takashi's mom in the picture too? Oh yeah, isn't... Okay, I kind of fucked up in the dialogue right there. Because they say... Um... gonna put wait wasn't takashi mom in the picture too is it i think it was comma s right blank moms oh shit is she really how much does she charge for it quickie how much does he charge for a quickie? Damn, dude, that's gross. Shut up. What? You mad? At you what? You mad? It's not our fault that your mom's a whore. I said. Oof, I messed up. I wish. Isn't there like a, a spell check thingy? Ah, dude. He ain't gonna do shit. We're at school. Unless you want to get suspended, then I suggest you shut. Bam. Okay, so this needs to go before. I wish you could, like, trigger it at the same time as the dialogue, but I guess not. That's fine.
Mm, what did okay so let's see front school front Okay, why isn't this? I asked myself why I even bothered to save that girl. And would you look at that? I just answered my own question. Well, that's what's, well, what's done is done. I can't do anything to help my situation. All I can do now is graduate from this dump and show them, they, them that they made a mistake. We'll see that. Oh, looks like it's already lunchtime. Things sure go by fast when you're in deep thought. It was about time. I could feel my stomach yelling at me for food. Sorry, buddy. It's going to be a, the usual for, for today as well. Can't seem to catch a break this week. Money is short. All right, cool. Nice. Very nice. Um, when do you plan on making the next episode of Yandera Diaries? Uh, Funko, it's going to be, um, hope hopefully next week. I'm currently writing like a couple of episodes as we speak right now, so... Starting next week, um, I'm going to be pumping out like the next episodes of Yandere Diaries. For this week, though, I'm going to be um, showcasing or doing a marathon of episode, I believe, episode 10, which is everybody's favorite. So, yeah. With a and a at the end. So stay tuned for that one. You freaking love the illustrations. Out of curiosity, would Sailor Spoon ever voice again? Uh, I don't know, Inertia. Uh, I'm going to have to ask her if she's interested in doing it. Although I feel like she wouldn't do it because of personal um, things that I'm not, I can't say. Um, but if she ever decide, if she ever like wants to do it, like I'd be more than happy to have her as a voice actor for me. So. The text bug came straight out of Doki Doki laughing my ass. <laughs> yeah, it kind of does seem like Doki Doki, huh? But that's why I'm going to change it. Um, like, for, as of now, I don't really care about the aesthetics as much. It's not priority. Right now, the priority is getting this, um, the main story finished. So, and then I'm going to work on, like, the different routes I can implement and change it around. So, dude, this is crazy. I already have, like, almost oof dude this is a lot there's already 300 lines um but and this is only chapter one dude dude <laughs> chapter two is gonna be pretty cool Sniper, this channel is worth more than 24k. It's worth at least 10 mil. Bruh, you praise me too much, man. Thanks for thanks a lot, Sniper. I really appreciate it. Um, I, I've been I don't know, I've been getting a lot of comments like that where people say, like, oh, this channel it should be at like a mil or something like that. And I'm like, bruh, I don't know, man. That that that's very flattering. Like, I really do um appreciate the 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 praise. Like, it really means a lot to me. Because I feel like um, the things I do on this channel is, like, cherished more, in a way. I don't know. Is that weird? Is that weird to say, like, people cherish your content more? Or the cherish the things you do f um, and, and make? It's like how people, like, undervalue something, but they cherish it because it's good. Or they personally like it kind of thing. 
So, I mean, just that in itself is like good enough for me. Like, sure, having like a million subscribers or something would be pretty nice. But like, honestly, as long as people like my stuff, I, it kind of motivates me to keep going and making stories that you guys would enjoy. Uh, my only dream, honestly, at this point is like, hopefully one day I could like um, make it. So I'm a director, so I'm some f movie or something be a film director or something like that or a director for animation or something like actually i kind of want to do like a rooster teeth kind of thing like where we'll start out as an indie indie um studio with a bunch of people um animating stuff and taking the stories i made in order to like make a franchise or a uh like multitudes of animated episodes or something like that kind of like ruby but better uh, I'm not a fan of I've like I've watched a little bit of Ruby, but it's like the story isn't there anymore. It kind of like it's all all over the place. So I kind of want to do make it like that. So I start from uh, start off small, then slowly create my own create a studio of some sort in order to like animate these episodes or these stories and stuff for you guys because that would be pretty cool. Like I would watch it myself. I'm pretty hyped just thinking about it. I would watch that content myself just just even though i made it i know everything's gonna happen i would still watch it myself because i i enjoy it if i feel like if i enjoy the content and pretty excited about that kind of stuff then i feel like other people would enjoy it too i don't know but that would be pretty sick though if i could get like uh animators and stuff like that to help me out with this kind of stuff um did you start yandere stories by reading them off the web Yes, yes, I did. Um, at first, I kind of got the idea, or I kind of figured the uh, the genre of Yandere through Mirai Nikki, uh, and then I saw other people, um, you know, writing on forums and that kind of stuff about about their experiences with a real um, crazy girlfriend or whatever, and that kind of inspired me to do it, and that's how it started, really. This channel is so much content that has more variety from life stories to Yandere's to English covers. To be honest, it's, it's un the undervalued since the audience is, is so spread out. Yeah, I, Inertia, yeah, I feel like you're right. Like, even though this channel has so much different types of videos on it, I, I put my feet in almost everything I could think of, um, except for vlogging, because I feel like vlog, I'm not a camera person. Ironically, I'm on live stream, but live stream and doing camera work like in public is so different. I'm not a camera person like that, so vlogging wouldn't be my thing. Like I don't, I can't see myself doing vlogs that often unless I'm with a person, with someone like friends or something like that. But I try to, I try to find my own, um, you know, my own ground in terms of what I like doing. And out of everything I've tried, this is probably the the only thing that I feel like confident in doing um everything like i like my english covers and stuff because that's where i started with my youtube channel is doing english covers but i i noticed that it's kind of difficult to do those um especially when you're kind of in in like panic mode all the time because you know copyright and i'm not talking about just like copyright claims or getting demonetized or anything like i don't care if like if like an english cover gets demonetized and i make no money out of it that's totally fine i don't care as long as it's out there for people to enjoy that's totally fine with me my only my only fear is that it gets claimed not claimed but it, get, it gets a strike and it like strikes my channel that's my only fear out of it that's why i kind of don't really lean on english covers as much anymore because of the fact that i did get like strike twice um luckily the first time i got striked um it was like a while back ago um but i got one strike and then a couple years after that, um, it, the strike was lifted. Then the next year after that, I got striked again. And that was like no, strike one again. So it kind of the strikes kind of reset itself. But it, technically, I would have had two strikes in a row if it wasn't for the fact that I kind of stopped doing um, English club, even English covers for a bit. So it's kind of scary. Because your livelihood all depends on like everything you do and all the content you've ever made gets deleted automatically which kind of sucks because you can't re-download all your content and make a new channel i don't know dude it's it's pretty frightening to be honest but yeah 
When is this game coming out? Um, I, I can't really tell. What ha whatever happened to Arakachi? Uh, she she kind of um I don't know. I I mean if if I ever want her back as a voice actor, I can always ask her to see if she's up for it. But I don't know. I don't really like m the voice actors who who voice in these Yandere stories. Don't really is Yandere stuff isn't really their thing. So a lot of the times they don't really aren't in it for like the the genre or that kind of stuff. They're kind of just doing it for the voice acting work, which is totally understandable. I would do the same thing. Um, but th they don't really like, I don't really talk to them like that, or I'm not that friendly with them like that. Although I kind of should be just because, you know, I want to make more friends and stuff on YouTube and, and like get my, and get a friend group of YouTubers and stuff like that in order to like collaborate more with other people. So I don't know. Did you start Yandere stories by reading them off the web? Yeah, I think I already read this. Jaden Day Zero in a Yandere for <laughs> Bradago. That's pretty funny. What if we got the Discord together and made an abridged anime? That would be funny. <laughs> yeah, that would be pretty funny. Wasn't there a cousin of Sigma of the of the wing with Jaden in it? Yeah, funny you should say that. There is, um, yeah. Let me show you real quick. I'm actually about to end the stream, but I will show you that I did do an abridged series. Where is it? I think it was in playlists. I don't know. I, I thought I, I had a playlist of things I'm in, but I don't know. Mm. Yeah, projects I'm in. Yeah, I'm in like freaking this Dragon Ball GT Abridge episode two, whatever, but it got demonetized by Toei Animation. Also some, a couple of fan dubs I've, I did back in the day. I'm in this. This is pretty much me. Hi there, I'm Yana. And I'm Kazu. I'm not gonna play the whole thing because I'm gonna get demonetized. But this is um, I did a like an abridged. I voiced as Kazuma in this freaking abridged series, which is pretty funny. I also did like a like a fan dub of this of the show a long time ago. Like, dang, this is from 2013, guys. Like, holy crap, dude, that's old. But yeah. I did used to do fan uh, fan dubs in a bridge series. I'm still working on like the um, school days uh, fan dub with somebody else, so that's something I've been working on, um, which is g going pretty well because the guy who I'm working with, he's doing very good work with like writing the scripts for the school days fan dub, and I'm pretty much like gonna edit everything in. And I'm right now I'm currently like looking for voice actors for like episode seven, so that should be out very soon. Hopefully um, everything goes well and I get traction, but I don't know. Young Dead Story is a bridge starring Jade and Day and Discord friends. I'm glad, gladly to be a writer. Improv is so much funnier though. Would be a voice than Ramen Boy. Kind of un unemployed right now. I'd write and voice act for you. Doggo, yeah, man. Like I do, I, I some I do like do um, pay voice actors and stuff. So. If anybody's like willing want to like check out my casting call club um, what profile, I usually have like casting calls projects on here. This is where I post my like voice acting stuff. So here are the projects for casting calls I'm looking for currently at the moment. Um, school days is open although if you're a guy you can't there isn't really any for any for guys but i do have a lot of of female voice actors and i'm paying like five bucks per person so i don't know yeah 
just just keep on the lookout for my projects on casting call club and um i do pay my voice actors so i don't know would you ever consider making a game out of episode eight after you extend the story yeah yeah that'd be pretty cool like i'd probably make a little short store a little short um game or i might expand on it a little bit more maybe because i think that would be pretty interesting kind of i kind of want to like i don't know if you guys are familiar with charon Charon is a very famous Yandere um, video game developer. Um, he makes a lot of the the a lot of the Charon games. I don't know. You probably saw them around the internet, but they're pretty infamous, or I guess they're pretty famous. Uh, to lack of a better term, I guess. Um, but I kind of want to be like a Charon, um, where I can all all these different games have like their own thriller psychological thriller kind of thing which i think it's really cool like the stories that charon tells in his games are really good like no joke it's like not boring at all they're very they're not long they're not too long but they're short enough and they they expand on the story a lot and a lot of it is connected somehow like a cinematic universe of some sort and a freaking cool dude like i like charon like one day i really hope because charon i believe he's japanese so he, and he doesn't speak english like i did tweet at him a couple times um he did respond but he, very limited because he doesn't know english based on what i can see but he's a he seems like a pretty cool person i, I kind of wish i could like talk to him to collaborate with him but like you know or her i don't know if charon's a guy or a girl but that he he's a pretty cool dude Oh, thanks, Maru. <laughs> Be my manager. Watch your life while being live. Are you coding soon? Are you coding, son? Yeah, I'm totally coding. I guess I'm kind of coding. Would you consider this coding? I don't know. Not really, because uh, I'm more like coding my script inside the game, I guess. I can do Spanish on the stories. <laughs> nice. As much as Yandere is popular, I'm sure it feel constricted. Yeah, I agree. I, I agree with that. Yandere can't. The Yandere genre is kind of constrictive because there's only so much you can do with it. That's why I'm trying to expand more into the other genres as well, not just Yandere, but like Sundere. I like I don't know if you guys saw it, but I do. I am planning on making like a Sundere stories kind of thing. Um, let's. I don't, I don't know how that's gonna go, but hopefully it's good. Um, then try other kind of stuff. That's interesting. So, is it a group of people? Kleenex box? I don't know. I I don't know if Charon is a group of people. I thought Charon was just one people, one person doing it. If it's three people, then I guess collectively Charon is like, as a group, is pretty cool then. I don't I have no idea I thought I for the longest time I thought Sharon was just a single person but I don't know all right um I'm probably gonna end the live stream here I'm gonna save everything I pretty much have I don't know if I feel like I didn't really make too much progress here I got through the um the flashback and added more context to it so it, it makes it clear as to what kind of character Yuji is. So, because I feel like in this, in the original dialogue, I kind of s s skimmed through it a little bit, didn't really include a lot of information, but this is more detailed and you get to know what his thoughts are a little bit more. So, and his situation without directly telling you his situation. He implies the situation he's in without like direct, like for example, he doesn't have a lot of money. So he says like, oh, not today. It looks like I'm, I'm just gonna be eating melon bread for this for, for today as well. So it that indirectly implies to the, to the reader that he doesn't have a lot of money on him. So, and that's why he's doing those jobs that, that he got slammed for. So I don't know, but yeah. Anyway, um, enough of me ranting. Uh, I remember looking it up and the said there were three people is probably the guy. Huh. Okay. Nice. I know it's cliche, but Yandere love potion plot? Mm, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I feel like it wouldn't be a Yandere story at that point. 
because it's just magic. But that's just me. Um, but yeah, um, thanks guys for coming by. Um, I really appreciate the support. Thank you so much. Like, I really do. Um, big shout out to, um, to my boy. <laughs> To my boy Aqua Dragon for donate for donating five dollars. I really do appreciate all the donations. Um, I I don't know if anybody's interested, but I will be opening up members YouTube members thing where um, with underneath every video there's like a little join button thing where you can join my um, my YouTube members thing and you just it's like Patreon in a way. Um, you only, you only don't, you only have to donate like a dollar every, every month and you get like a special emote with it, which I think is kind of funny here. I'll show you guys the emote I came up with for like chat. So whenever, um, I'm live streaming or anything, you can actually get to see the emote, which I came up with this one right here. I photoshopped everything myself, so I, I'm pretty proud of it. I think it's hilarious. It's like the Yandere Poggers emote. Which will be available to you in chat if you um, join. I don't know if I oh, if you can guys can see it. Oh man, dude, that sucks. Okay, come on, come on, computer, show the poggers. Yeah, here it is. Like, look at that. It's beautiful, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, you'll be able to use this emote in chat by being a member. And also this like little, the badge, this little knife with a heart will appear next to your name. Um, if you do, which I think is pretty cool. I don't know, but yeah. Um, anyways, aside from that, I uh, appreciate everybody. Big shout out to John Mitchie on Patreon for like being my Patreon supporter every month. So big shout out to him and Make sure to subscribe, um, follow if you are not subscribed or followed yet, turn on notifications, all that junk. And yeah, I, I'm mostly on Twitter. So if you guys want to follow me on Twitter as well as um, TikTok, I guess, and like Instagram and Facebook and stuff. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah. Thanks again, everybody. Hope you guys have a great week. If I don't see you on Wednesday, I will see you next week. Or I'll, I will see everybody on Friday because Friday I'm going to be doing a, a, a marathon. So stay tuned for that on Friday. Other than that, hope you guys enjoy everything else I've been making. And yeah, stay tuned for next week or Wednesday. I'll see you guys on Wednesday then. All right. I'm, I'm, I, I suck at outros. Sorry about that, but I'm done. I'm done talking. <laughs> All right, guys. Bye. Peace. Good night.